Good evening everyone and welcome back to Game of Thrones, uh, the first episode in the new Telltale uh, series. It's really interesting already. So I'm going to go straight back into it because no talking. I want to know what's happening. Uh, medical supplies. There's a bucket. Bandages. Healing herbs. Them up. This might help. Oh, am I actually taking things from right next to him? Bandages. Yes, I am king stuff. So I guess I'm allowed to have it then. I'm going to touch his bucket. Rather cute little creatures, aren't they? Ugh. It's a bucket of maggots. Okay, I think I'm done playing around. Mm. Mm -hmm. Did you Let's talk to him. No. I just wanted to ask you. Um. Why do the White Hills hate the foresters? I think it's safe to say the feeling is mutual. There's been enmity between the two houses for as long as anyone can remember. <laughs> someone killed someone, which led to more killings of someone's, and then, well, here we are. Hmm. So the White Hills are our rivals, apparently. I know who the new lord of the house the White is. White Hills want Forrester Ironwood. Ah, they'd take it all if we'd let them, especially now with the Boltons in power. And proceed to clear-cut every last inch of it until there's nothing left. Just as they've oh dear. done before. Oh, they've done before. Can I go now? I believe your leg will be fine. Any time will tell, but... Lady Forrester. Well, ah, women. Welcome home, Garrett. We're all relieved to know you survived. Thank you, my lady. Talia asked to see you. Garrett, I heard what happened. Is it true? Your family... Oh, my family. I thought you meant yours. I'm so sorry. I guess I already knew that Forrester was dead. Off to bed now. Hurry on. She's so cute. She's far too young for me. My sword is too Gary big. Just <laughs> me how valiantly Lord Forrester fought to the end, even when all was lost. I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. He saved my life, my lady. Yet not Roderick's. You were with Roderick, no? I'm sure it was chaos and confusion. But if you can remember anything, I'm sure Lady Forrester would like to know. I'm sorry, my lady. Nothing could be done to save him. He was House Forrester's best. Nothing could save him because he got crushed by a fucking cart. This has been so incredibly difficult for us, especially the children. But I was told. I was told you were the last to see my husband alive. Yes, my lady. Yes. I know it may be difficult to remember, but if I may ask, was there anything he said? Any last words before he passed, if you can remember? He asked me to return this to House Forrester. He said this is where it belongs. With his family. Thank you, Garrett. Of course, my lady. He demands a response. It's too dangerous, especially now. <laughs> I wasn't going to tell her. I promise I gave my word that I would only tell my uncle what he said. Duncan, this was our land. They were our people. Your family. I share your outrage, Sir Royla. I do. Oh, is that my uncle? No time to provoke the White Hills. Not with Ramsay Snow coming to see us bend the knee. The hell with Ramsay Snow, the bastard. Garrett, you understand what this means. You killed a Bolton, and Ramsay Snow will want his retribution. We're the ones that should be demanding retribution. This happened on Forrester land. They attacked, they attacked me. me. And they'll say they were keeping the peace in the name of House Bolton. It's an argument you cannot win. We have to be smart. Ramsay Snow will be here within the week. And what would you have us do? Nothing. I would have us use our heads while they're still attached to our shoulders. Garrett has lost his oh, all right. else within these walls. Maybe you Maybe can... Ramsey Snow. Garrett suffered enough already. 
You ask too much of the boy. He deserves to be heard. My uncle is right. We need to be smart. Smart. Eddard Stark was smart. And look where that got him. So Eddard Stark was stubborn. <sighs> Kill me. It will be for Lord Ethan to decide. He's just a boy who can barely hold a sword. He knows nothing of how to lead men. He is the lord of this house, and he needs our help. It's bad enough the Boltons would have us bend the knee and swear fealty. But now, this. But I'll accuse you of murder, and us of protecting you. The boy was just defending himself. I'm not faulting him for what he did. It wasn't murder. murder. It was justice. Not in their eyes. It's just the excuse Ramsay Snow would need to put us to the torch and kill us all. I'd like to see them try. I'm afraid it's a risk we cannot take. Which is why you can't. Oh, stop. man. You cannot what? Take Duncan, the boy has suffered enough. Let them come. I don't care. They'd kill you and not think twice about it. It's not safe for you here, Garrett. There's only one oh. place beyond the reach of the Boltons. You're sent to the wall. The boy's done nothing wrong. Not in the eyes of the Boltons. Ah, oh, what? A solution, especially now, when the house is so vulnerable. I'll do what's best for the house. So I'll go. I'm not afraid. I know it doesn't seem fair. I'm gonna go to the wall. That settles it then. You can have my horse, and I'll see you have plenty of food. But we haven't much time. The White Hills will come looking for you. Dude, I'm going to the wall. Does this mean I can never go anywhere else? Am I going to spend the whole game at the wall? Surely not. No offense. I'd gladly drive a sword through Lord Whitehill's heart if given the chance. <laughs> I would. And God's willing, someday I will. But for now, I have House Forrester to consider. I need, I need to tell him the thing. Forrester would be proud that you're putting the interests of the house ahead of your own. I've got to tell him the thing. His best men have volunteered for the war. His own great uncle was a ranger with the Night's Watch. He promoted me at the Twins. We were to ride in the van to Casterly Rock, and and I at Roderick's side, but. It was well deserved, Gareth. You worked hard and served your lord with honor. And now I get to go to the wall. Oh, gee. Right moment to tell you. Yeah. What? What is it? Lord Forrester asked me to give you a message. He said, the North Grove can never be lost. Sorry, yes. Sorry. You caught me by surprise. It's not often discussed. He said to tell only you. He said tell only you. For good reason. Most don't even know it exists. They think it's just Ooh. made up by wildlings and fools. And it's better kept that way. I Ooh. assume you kept your word. You haven't yeah. told anyone else, have you? Nope. Not a soul. It's important, Garrett. I've told no one. I told no one. Well done. Lord Forrester was right to put his trust in you. From this day forward, this will be our secret. But soon, okay. I may need your help. What? I can't say anything more just yet. Just know the North Grove may very well be vital to the future of this house. But don't breathe a word of it to anyone. Ooh, what's in the North Grove? It will help. What's in the North Grove? I am from ice. I am from ice. Remember, you represent House Forrester. Your actions at the war will reflect the honor and dignity of the house. I'll serve with honor. I know you will. Man. I kind of want to go to the wall, but I don't want to go to the wall. I don't want to stay at the wall. Maybe just like a passing visit. Jared, wait. You love me? I know. 
What is it? It doesn't bend. Uh. Oh. Safe. Oh. I'll come back. I promise. I don't promise because my uncle's glitching. Man, this sucks. Balls. <laughs> I'm of two minds. I want to go to the wall, but I don't want to go to the wall. <laughs> oh. Ethan. Ethan Forrester. Lord of House Forrester. There he is. Looking all slimy. Apparently he plays the loot. Couldn't find him. Could you? <laughs> and if he was smart, he would reveal himself. There's suspicion in those eyes. Maybe something happened to him. Ethan's fine. He's just forgotten this is a game. <laughs> you found me. Well done, Ryan. Oh, it's just a game, Ryan. A stupid game. I don't like it. He was worried you were gone. I thought we'd never find you again. Oh. And I promise, I'm not going anywhere. I wish Mira was here. And Asha. And... And Roderick. I do too. But Mira's in King's Landing and... Can't she come home? I don't want her to die too. Oh, she's she not gonna die. Perfectly safe, I promise you. She'll be alright. I don't want Gareth to die either. Maester Ortengrin said he got sent to the wall. I'll miss Gareth. He was nice. Garrett, Garrett is strong. He can take care of himself. No one will tell me what Garrett did, but it must have been serious. I heard Duncan and Sir Royland talking. They said someone will come here looking for revenge. Everyone's worried about you, but I'm not. I know you'll protect us. Who said they're worried about me? Well, oh. Sir Royland for one. He says you can't fight very well. What? <laughs> You're shit. Your milk salt. Milk salt. Sir Roiland forgets himself. He doesn't know me or, or what I'm capable of. What does milk salt <laughs> mean? I don't know. Oh, <laughs> I know it's not good. It means you're an idiot. You should let Sir Roiland teach you how to wield a sword. Like, like a man. Yeah. He taught Roderick and Asha, and he even showed me how to fight. Properly, I mean. <laughs> I you should know how to fight. <laughs> oh, even Talia's better we all used to play here you me Roderick Asher we'd all be out here for hours but not Mira <laughs> where was I you weren't born yet it's you were life. a twinkle in your father's eye and everything changed Roderick became so serious the Lord in training he never smiled anymore and Asher <coughs> <was just angry. coughs> sorry everything promise me you won't be like that Please, just be you. I like you the way you are. With my derpy hair. The world has many responsibilities, but you don't need to be like them. I promise, I won't change. Good. I won't change how I am. Have a brother than a lord. You'll have to have both, I'm afraid. <laughs> You're always gonna have to have both, but or a father and a lord. Since you're the new lord. You can do anything you want. I suppose. Yep. I can smack you around the head if I want. I could have all the sweets I want. Mm, <laughs> no. It would be nice if someone did what I wanted for once. That's not how it works. Well, that's how it should work. <laughs> I agree, that is how it should work. Sweets for all. But no, it's not practical. You're needed in the great hall at once. Quickly, on your feet. I'm needed. I am a hero now. What's the matter? Lord Whitehill has arrived, unannounced and certainly unexpected. He's oh dear. Demanding justice. Can't he meet with Duncan? He is the Castellan. Stay with us, please, Ethan. No, I have to go. An audience with the Lord. We yeah. really must go. It's your decision. You are the Lord. 
If I were Lord, I would command you I need to go for this family. Fine. If that's what's required of me. Very well then. I will go. Because I am a lord. But I'll come back. Oh, they're so sad and tragic looking. Oh, don't wear babies. I'll come back to you. And I'll still be poncy. Right. <coughs> I've got a cough. Come. It won't go away. Um, but we need to end it there anyway. <coughs> before I run over. And maybe I'll have a cough. Um, but yeah, it's getting really interesting now. I'm presuming I'm going to be playing as multiple characters. Because otherwise, it's a bit... Because kind of the wall is the be all and end all, really. You can't really leave the wall. It's like exile, so I'll be stuck there forever as Garrod. Um, whereas I'm guessing I get to... <laughs> maybe be Lord Ethan. Because that'd be fun. Get to be a lord. Hmm. He's a bit poncy though. Maybe not quite as poncy as the picture looked, but you know, oh well. Um, but yes, it's good. It's good. It's really good. And I can't wait to keep playing. So I will see you guys real soon. Hopefully you're enjoying it too. And uh, take care for now. Bye.